Hi Year 2, how are you? Lovely to see you. I'm sure you're very happy to see me in your home. Now, I've got a little maths investigation for you today. Now I'm sure you're all very familiar with this. This is a hundred square. And if you don't have one at home, don't worry, I've attached one to this video. So click on the link below and you'll open up this hundred square, okay? Now, your task there is you're going to play a little bit of a game. If you want to, you can use your parents or your brothers or sisters to play with you, or if not, you can play with yourself, okay? Now, you're going to get a counter of any description, something that you can put on top of the 100 square after you've printed it out, okay? And you're going to start at number one, all right? So, for example, I can't think of anything I want to put on my, for my counter, so what have I got here? Ah, I've got a pen lid. I'm going to put my pen lid on number one, and that's going to be my counter, okay? And then you're going to play a game. You're going to roll a die. Now don't worry, if you don't have a die, I've got a link to a, a virtual die in the description below. So click on that and you can play with a die that's online. If you've got a die, great. Just find one in a board game or something, okay? Now the aim of this game is to get your counter from the 1 to the 99, okay? But the only way you're going to do that is by rolling a dice and answering some questions, okay? Now this is quite a long game, you might want to play it in like a half time, so the first person to get to 50, that's half time, okay, and then play the rest another day. But here's how the game works, let's imagine I roll a 5, okay, let's see it, roll a 5, cool, there we go, I've rolled a 5. Now I've started on 1, okay, let's see where I land, I've got 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so I've landed on 6. So in order for my counter to stay on 6, which is what I want, I've got to add those together. 6 plus 1. Now that's quite an easy one because we only just started the game. 6 plus 1, I know, is 7. Okay, 6 and 1 is 7. Great, I get to stay on that counter. Now it's my friend's turn. Okay, they've rolled a 3. Let's see where they land. They land on 4. So to get to stay on there, they've got to add 1 to 4, which we know equals 5. Starts really easy, but it does get harder. Let's imagine I'm on the number 22, and I roll a 1, which takes me to 23. I'm not going to be able to do that just straight in my head. I'm going to use my column method. So I'm going to put my 22 and my 23 in the correct columns, and then I'm going to add them up. Remember, we always start at our smallest value. So in this case, it's my units. 2 add 3, it gives me a 5. Move along into my 10s. 2 add 2 gives me 4, gives me a grand total of 45. So I get to say, yep, yeah, 45, have I got that right? Yes, great, I get to stay on that 23 now. Fantastic, now it's my friend's turn. Okay, so this is a fun game for you guys. I hope you enjoy it. Like I say, if it takes loads and loads of time, just stop at 50 or call that half time, it's up to you. There's a link in the description below to get the 100 square and the link in the description below with all these instructions on for you to follow and a virtual dice link as well. So you can just click on that and play with the dice online if you haven't got one in real life. Okay, year two, I hope you enjoy that. I'll check back in with you soon. Bye-bye.